All right, something new. We are uh, gonna do a little read along. We're gonna do it in Genesis, Barashit. And um, we'll also try in uh, Septuagint here, Reader's Edition. We'll do uh, a little bit of it in Greek as well. So let's just jump right in. Uh, I will read the Hebrew and, you know, probably maybe do a literal verbatim thing. We'll see how far we go here and whatnot. But, uh, Barashit bara Elohim et ha shemaim va et ha aretz. In beginning, uh, Barashit, he, he created bara God Elohim et. What is et? That is Aleph de Tav, um, the whole shebang. The heavens, Hashemaim, and uh, Va'et, uh, the earth, Ha'aretz. And the earth, uh, Va'ha'aretz, she was Ha'yita, formless, ta, to, Tohu, and empty, um, Va'vohu, and darkness. Uh, over all the face, pani the deep, uh, and the spirit of God, uh, Elohim, hovering, maracha, uh, sorry, marachabet, uh, over all the face, pani the waters, hamaim, and he said, God, uh, va. Uh, va yom, va uh, Elohim, let him be light, or uh, let the light, the pre existing light, come forth. Uh, yehi or, va yehi or, and he, and he was light, or and light was. And he saw Elohim et, or va yira, and uh, a horrible translation, and and Vayera Elohim et so uh, Elohim saw et or witnessed et and he was in awe that that's Vayera. Um, uh, he saw the light. What was he in awe of? Um, that light that ha or uh, ki tov the light that was good tov va ha ha or ki tov. And he separated Elohim between the light and between the darkness. Va yavdil, I'm sorry, va yavdil Elohim ben haor uvayin ha choshek. And he called va yikra Elohim, God, uh, the lights la or day. Yom and the darkness he called nights. Vala Hushek Kara Lila. And he was evening and he was morning. Vayehi Arav Vayehi Vakar Vakar. Day one. Yom Ichad. And he said, uh, God, va ya omer Elohim, let let him be expanse in midst of waters. Excuse me. Ye yehi rakia ba ba tok ba tok hamim, and let him be separating between waters to waters. Va yehi ma va dol. Ma, ma, Mavadil ben Mim, or the son of the waters, uh, two waters, la Mim. And he made Elohim et. Va ya ish, va, va ya ish um, Elohim et, all of the tav, the expanse harakia, and he separated between the waters that from under to the expanse and the what. And between the waters, which from over to the expanse, he was so. Uh, where were we here? At Harakia va ya va yev 
ויבדול בין המים אשר מתחת לרקיע ובפין המים אשר מעל לרקיע ויהי קין. And he called Elohim the expanse heaven. Vayikra Elohim la rakia shemaim vayehi, and he was evening. El rav, and he was vayira morning. Vaker, day second, yom shani. Okay, where are we here? And he said, God, va ya omer Elohim, let them be gathered the waters, va 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 kavu hamaim from under ma tachet ma ma tachet the heavens into place one or one place the heavens hashamaim el ma ma makom makom echad and let her appear the dry ground vataraat vataret hadyabasha and he was so va yehi king and he called god the dry ground earth elohim la yabasha um, aretz and collection of the waters he called seas. Va la ma va la that's a tough one. Hamaim kara yamim. And he saw Elohim that good. Uh, and he saw va yira, or he was an awe, or the awe, va yira elokim kitov. Okay, that's a good place to stop on that one. So next we are going to uh, yeah, jump into the uh, Septuagint here. And uh, yeah, I just got, I just got this one. It's pretty awesome, actually. Um, okay, in in uh, Alexandrian Greek or Koine for sure, but it's you know, we'll just say it's Alexandrian. It sounds smart, whatever. Uh, Genesis. Um, and, and we're just going to run through it, you know. Um, since I already did the uh, translation over there in the Hebrew, this is, I don't want to say verbatim, but this is, you know, right close. The, in arke poiesen oteos ton yorano kai tengen. So in the beginning, uh, then, you know, teos, God created the yorano, heavens kai ton gen, the earth. He de gen, he aoratos. Uh, it was invisible, kai haka taskeu astos, um, without shape, kai skotos uh, epano, um, so it was above, and the darkness above, uh, tes abuso, um, the, the abyss, the deep, the uh, abuso, abyss. Kai panuma teo hepeferreto, uh, so the spirit of uh, the Lord was, you know, set upon the place. Hepano uh, above to udatos, the waters, hudatos. Kai haipeno deos gene theto fos, and he saw the light. Kai heganeto fos, and uh, the light was. Kai. Aideno deos to fos oto kalon, and so kalon is the fos is beautiful kalos kalon. Kai 
they call uh, racing uh, to separate some about that. They call racing or they use hana meson between to uh, f- the photos, the lights, kai hana uh, meson to skoto, so you separate the lights in the darkness. Kai hekales in o teos to fos hemera, hemeran kai to skotos hekales in nukta, kai heganeto es perad, so evening, kai heganeto peri, it was morning, himera mia, so day one. Okay, here we are here. Uh, kai uh, hypenoteos geneteto uh, stereoma, uh, the uh, the firmament stereoma. I always love that word, st- stereo. You know, it's like you know, everything in stereo, but it's the firmament. You know, in meso tohudatos the water kai histen diakorizon diakorizon. Uh, so the word is uh, the separate, but the acordezon, you know, acordezon like the you know heart in you know Spanish and Latin acordezon. Um, anywho, hana meson uh, between the hutatos kai hutatos uh, the waters and waters kai heganato oitos kai ipoyes en oteos tos te stereoma. Uh, the uh, you know firmament again kai dai ko resen the separate teos hana meson between to udatos the waters o uh, he u upokato uh, upokato or you know below under like krupto um, uh, uh, kato you know below uh, to uh, stereo matos kai hana meson to hudatos to uh, toi epano ep uh, epano above uh, toi uh, stereo matos excuse me the firmament um kai hekal hekalesen oteos to stereo ma um uh, the the yorano so the heavens the firmament so the heavens Kai Aiden, uh, he saw Aiden Oteos uh, Hoti Kalon. It was good, Kalos. Kai Higaneto es, uh, uh, es Sperma. Es Sperma. It was evening. Kai Higaneto uh, Peri. It was morning. Uh, uh, Hemera uh, Dutera. Um, we'll read a little bit more. And then, uh, you know what? I think we'll. Uh, yeah, we'll uh, take it easy on this one. And I think that's kind of a good start. This is, again, a totally experimental situation. So that's that's fun and that's all right. And um, uh, maybe we'll finish with something else, but, you know, we'll see what happens. But Kai hyphen oteos su su nak seto to Hudoro u po kato, blow under again. To yorano ais yoran oi na go go gen mian kai of of the to ais the ais sa he xera the the dry the dry. Kai Higaneto Huitos Kai Su Nek Su Nekse To Udor To Upo Kato To Yorano Aistas Yoran Yonago Gas Auto Kai O Of Sehe Xera. Well, there's that. That's that. And I was reading that. I was looking in the. You know, miscellaneous situation here, uh, what I had to finish up a situation, and um, I said, you know what, while we're here, we are going to literally randomly open something to Aristotle's metaphysics, and uh, you know what, if we can get that, um, we'll, we'll see what happens here. We're going to, um, 
the cause. Uh, we're going to see what he says about cause. Because this is just straight up random. Now this is Attic Greek. I'm going to read a little bit here, maybe a couple of sentences. And uh, he's saying the, uh, in Latin here we have... Uh, Causa vero dicitur uno quidem modo ex quo vita liquid in existente ut in stature in argentum fialeet horum genera. Alaio vera species et exemplar hoc alta mesa ratio ipsius quid erat esse et hui uh, huius uh, genera uh, ut aius quo dia, uh, dia passon uh, duo ad um, unum et tot, tot, totalitur numeris. Uh, so he's saying that, you know, something the, the uh, uh, cause means, number one, that from which an imminent material thing comes into being. Example, the bronze is the cause of the state of the silver of the saucer, and so are the uh, classes which use these, like, you know, the form or pattern, the definition, the essence, the clauses which include this. Uh, and, you know, we'll read it some in Greek. And, you know, it's interesting because it's like, you know, even looking at that, what we just read in Betasheet and Genesis, or the Genesis, the literally the, the generation in, in, uh, in the Greek, it's, it's, you know, it, it's the the essence of being coming forth, if you will, or potential actualizing. Uh, actualizing. Um, so anyway, let's read some Attic Greek just for the heck of it, because why not? I tion legetai hena men proton. There's proton first. Um, uh, hex. Um, ui gi genetai, there's the genesis, gi genetai ti enu par contos, oiano calcos toi andriantos caio arguros tes fayales. Kai ta toitin gene halon te to idos kai to para daigmar toi toi de esteno logos, the word logos toi ti and ai nai kai ta toito gene. Oyon toi dia pason to duo pros in kai holoso arithmos math you know arithmetic arithmos kai ta mere ta into logo hete o then he you know the arche just like in you know. Uh, the arche right in the beginning of Genesis, the, the beginning arche, arche tes uh, metaboles ton uh, um, proto, the first uh, um, he he tes he he re he re me seos uh, o o aion o boi le, leasas a, atios um, uh, kai o a pat, pater to tec, techno uh, kai ho, holos o po oi po ion, uh, to po aiu me no no how is that tongue twister uh, kai to meta ble tinon uh, toi meta um, balontos and um, yeah that's a good place to start uh, I'm sorry, a good place to stop. Ugh. Random, for sure, but um, yeah, that was... Uh
That was fun. That was uh, in, in Genesis, Hebrew and Genesis, and, um, and then the uh, Septuagint. Man, this is a whopper. This is only uh, from Genesis, bet a sheet all the way to 3rd Maccabees, and there's a whole other one of these, but fancy. Okay, well, until then, that was a good time.